Hello everybody and welcome to I Like Cruise Ships, the YouTube channel. Here we are on board Carnival Horizon. We're going to have a look at one of the Deck 9 cabins. This is 9208. So before we go in, it's very bright, that window is letting in a lot of light. I'm just going to point out here, this is the very forward part of Deck 9. And then just that other bright light, that circle right there, that's the door to the forward part of the ship, which is considered one of the secret decks. It's not so secretive. But uh, you can actually get outside and see the front part of the ship from there. And you've got your own kind of like big forward sort of balcony area, I guess. So we'll have a walk in and we'll look around. So this is kind of cool. This is embarkation day here on board Carnival Horizon. So the actual sofa is made up as a third bed already. So it's kind of interesting that you can see this now. That's not so typical. Mostly the sofa is kind of in place and then the bed gets made up in the afternoon. You can actually also see here, this can be a fourth bed, the Pullman bed, right here. So it's kind of neat. A look at some of the features of the desk right here. Oh, there's a pencil right on the floor. So we've got the fridge right here. And plenty of room there for some sodas, some bottled water. Maybe you brought your own juices from home. On the desk here, you've got a, a USB 110. Now we can't quite see, but there's a 220 plug behind the water there. You can just see that, right? Somebody's got some bottled water coming their way. I'll just get out of the mirror there. There's also some shelves there for storage, which we might do. We'll spin around and have a look at the wardrobe, shall we? So we've actually got three wardrobes in this cabin. So the first one you'll see has the shelves, the safe, and then the drawers. And then you've got two kind of opposite doors here. So you've got one side that's full hanging. Probably see a mirror there, so it looks like there's more. Uh, that's full hanging, plenty of hangers too. There's also some extra white ones there, which kind of turn up over time from the laundry. And then you've got the second one, which is a half hanger. And then there's a bar right here, which can basically come down to make a second uh, shelf. It's not gonna pop down with my one hand, but so you can actually add as, as two shelves and two half hangers, or a whole hanger. Let's actually just check out that drawer there. We just missed that in the little view there. That's the hairdryer. And then they've just moved the coffee table a little bit to the one side here. Generally in embarkation, they do the vacuuming. So they put the tables off to one side. The bed looks nice and inviting, doesn't it? And you've got little side tables. And the TV is switched off right now. So the TV is pretty much dead center from the bed. So it's great if you want to watch TV in bed, a nice big flat panel TV. So they're the actual uh, sofa blocks, I guess. Don't know how you describe that. And here we are, let's have a look outside. So we've got the, basically the big picture window. And then you've got the door then to the balcony. This is Miami, so we're gonna see a little bit of Star Island and Palm Island. So this is kind of a good sort of perspective here. So this is deck nine, of course. So the balcony here, you've got the two chairs and then the table. It's nice and calm out here today as well. Beautiful weather, beautiful blue skies. We can see the bay right here and then Palm Island. And the coolest thing is here, you can actually get a view of the bridge. So you don't have a perfectly forward view because the bridge is right there. And that's the actual bridge wing and the windows there. And then actually you can see, I just pointed out, if you went out that forward door, you could come out to that very forward sort of point right there. And then you'd almost, you'd have the kind of perfect forward view to see Royal Caribbean off in the distance. So yeah, it's a nice balcony, nice and, you know, it's, it's a beautiful day today. So it's so calm outside. It's not windy and blown out. You get a good idea of the space of the cabin here. So I imagine this is three people coming in this room and they've just got the room ahead, ready ahead of time a little bit. And there is actually storage under the bed. I always tend to forget to point this out, but you've got a lot of space under here for your luggage. Uh, fairly standard luggage would slide right under there. We'll come and have a look in the bathroom now. You've got the little uh, air conditioning adjustment. It's pretty easy up and down. This is a fairly standard bathroom we see on a lot of the uh, Horizon cabins. It's nice and uh, bright. There's a little extra plug there in the corner. So you've got the shelf space, and you've got the storage underneath, and then you've got the shower and toilet. So just remember shampoo and uh, shower gel, no conditioner. 
So always keep that in mind. Actually, one thing I'll kind of point out, which is kind of cool, they've got the bar soap right here. And one of the initiatives of Carnival is they've moved from plastic wrapping to cardboard wrapping, so it's easier for recycling. So I don't know if anyone's actually noticed that on their past cruises recently, they've got a lot of recycling initiatives going on now on the cruise lines. So yeah, so I hope you've liked the cabin walk around. I like cruise ships, the YouTube channel. We're here on board Carnival Horizon. And I thought this is a pretty cool cabin to check out. So I hope you liked it. Give it a thumbs up. Post a comment. Share it on social media. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, click subscribe. So I like cruise ships, the YouTube channel. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye.